I knew something was wrong, but it's football season. You don't miss football season. That's what you do. That's what you get paid to do. That's what I love. Well, I got to practice and uh, started hand passing out the, the gear. Whenever I stood up, I felt like I was having a stroke. My head was just pounding. And my heart was racing. So my, my best friend is my doctor. She's like a sister. So I, I, I called uh, Vonda Houchin, Dr. Houchin. I said, Vonda, I'm coming to see you. And I was like, uh, no, turn around, go to the emergency room. I'll meet you over there. We'll get, we'll get the right team come to see you. You don't need to drive to Harrisburg and then turn right around and get in the ambulance and come back to Jonesboro. She said, no, you're headed to St. Bernard's. Young lady came in, took my vitals. She said, coach, is that you? And I was like, yeah. And she laid her hand on me and said, Lord bless this man. Dr. Nair is top notch. I, I, I trust her above, I mean, honestly, anybody in the state, in the, in the United States, to be honest with you. I mean, I just think she's wonderful. The hardest part of that period was, uh, was, was wondering if I was gonna get to see my daughter walk down the aisle, uh, see my son grow up, become a man, and just wondering, you know, am I gonna be able to go back and be a coach? A lot of people dread going back to school after Christmas break because you've had that time off. I couldn't wait to get back. I knew I was gonna to get to be back and be a part of it again and just be a coach again. You know, do, do what I know. I mean, that's all I know to do and uh, get, get to be Coach Darby again. <laughs>